Caller Virus. Item Number SCP-8530 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures Before any researchers test on SCP-8530, they have to get the preventive vaccine once every month. If someone gets infected, they have to be placed under permanent quarantine until they die or show no symptoms due to the vaccine. SCP-8350 is to be kept in airtight containment, and it has to be 10 by 10 feet. Before entering SCP-8530's containment cell, Foundation personnel have to be sterilized and wear a hazmat suit for testing. Description SCP-8350 is a pathological virus that's similar to the flu, but worse. SCP-8350's origin started in a small town in blank, Canada. The virus is believed to have come from a cave dug up by miners close to the town. During the first week, the people of the small town started feeling symptoms of the virus. Stage 1 symptoms of the virus are coughing, high or lower fever, and minor difficulty with breathing. The virus is worse to kids that feel stage 3 symptoms with intense sweat. Coughing, high fever, sweating, and some kind of pox that's related to chicken pox. Stage 2 symptoms of the virus are similar to stage 1, but a little bit worse. During stage 4 symptoms, the virus has spread throughout the body, and the symptoms are seizures, intense coughing, having difficulty breathing, intense sweat and some inability to move. All of this happens until death. The Foundation heard news of this when they sent out people to the town and found all of the town dead. When they came back, the researchers felt symptoms of the virus, and a couple of days later, they were dead. The government called in the Foundation and took DNA samples of the dead people and found out the virus wasn't any other virus that we had seen. The Foundation quarantined the people who came into contact with the infected and put SCP-8350 in containment. Addendum 8350-1 The vaccine came after months of research. The vaccine is a mixture between the flu vaccine, the chickenpox vaccine, and a flu vaccine. It is given by nasal spray. Addendum 8350-2 The Foundation believes that they are getting closer to the cure for the virus, and getting rid of the virus entirely, but more testing has to be done.